So I'm here in Las Vegas at Chef Amaury's Pastry Academy. And I've come here to measure the largest chocolate sculpture of a fruit. I've done my measuring. I can confirm that it is 66 inches by 29.57. Congratulations, you are officially amazing. Thank you so much. Uh, so tell me about the art of making a piece of chocolate like this. Well, there is a, a, a handful of us chefs in the world uh, being able to craft chocolate to that scale. Not only the material is very precious, it's very expensive, but it requires a lot of working years after years to be able to master it enough to be able to bend it to your will. Uh, the difficulty is that chocolate, being so unique, can present itself under a liquid form and a solid form at the exact same temperature, which makes it hard to work with, but also it opens possibility. And what I've been doing over the last decade is to try to find technique and method to use this simple, beautiful material into pieces of art. Do you have a vision in your mind before you start? Do you know? Yeah, what you're I think after a while, the, the, the first few years of doing it, it was a lot of trial and error. Now I have a little bit of a better 3D vision. The mold, the mold I use are usually very basic, an egg shape, a round shape, a pot, uh, and then the, it's really the assembly and putting it together that turns it into the art piece. But I, I don't like to use too much intricate mold. And any plans for any more Guinness World Records titles? Oh yeah, I think now we're on a roll. Uh, this is just the second one, uh, and I hope there will be many more to come. So you're in our book. How did you feel? Uh, it's it's awesome. And I'll tell you, I was not a, a very book-driven kid growing up, but uh, I always had every single uh, edition, the Guinness World Record, and I remember being just wowed into the, the extravagance of the world. So being feature, uh, doing what I do and what I love doing is, is a very beautiful feeling. It's me.